First at six, we continue to follow this breaking news alert in Volusia County. A wanted man is shot by a deputy and a police officer. We're told the suspect is now at the hospital in critical condition. This is News 6 at 6. I'm Matt Austin. And I'm Lisa Bell. Sheriff Mike Chitwood spoke with News 6 about an hour ago saying the suspect was armed with a gun. This is all developing on a stretch of U.S. 17 in DeLand. If you are familiar with that area, it is less than a mile away from the at-home Express Tangerine Inn. News 6 is Eric Von Anken is there. And Eric, this suspect was wanted on attempted murder charges before today's shooting. In fact, we've reported on him before. We did exactly that, Lisa. Remember, on November night, deputies here in Volusia County put out an alert saying they wanted to find this guy for trying to kill one of his friends, and that's when we turned to you and we brought this to you here on News 6. Well, they got word that he was coming down 1792 here, or 17, I should say, from Lake County, headed towards the land. That's when they moved in. They tried to stop him. Bullets were flying. Somehow, no deputies, no police officers were hit. But Sheriff Chitwood says this was about as close as it gets. So when you sum it all up, you got a violent felon who's got his hand on a firearm, tries to take out the police, and eventually ends up getting shot by us. Volusia County Sheriff says deputies got a tip that violent convicted felon Dylan Parker, the one on the right in this picture from deputies, wanted for shooting the one on the left earlier this month, was headed their way down US 17. The sheriff says Parker was in that gold car and when he spotted a deputy, he tried to ram the patrol car. Deputies set up stop stick shortly after, blew out Parker's tire, sending him into this ditch. But the sheriff says Parker got out running and shooting. The deputy fired back, shooting through the windshield, but Parker kept running and shooting, the sheriff says, until a DeLand police officer, just on his way to work, saw it all, stopped, and fired his rifle at Parker, finally taking down Parker. When the deputies and DeLand get up on top of him, because he's laying face down, as they roll him over, he's still got the gun in his hand and throws the gun out. We could be here discussing that I have a dead deputy or a dead DeLand police officer. And even after all of that, even after the sheriff says they got the gun that tried to kill them away from Parker, deputies moved in along with paramedics and they started doing CPR, trying to revive him or at least keep him alive. They flew him out of here to the hospital. We're told that he's at the hospital right now, Matt and Lisa. He's been shot in the chest and he's been shot in the thigh, but he is alive. Eric Von Inken reporting live for us in Volusia County. Thank you.